Welcome to Malaysia. Have a look around. We reach zero COVID cases now. It's lockdown, but no changes. Citizens raise white flag. Politicians are scumbag. Vaccines is so slow, just like how the brains flow. Welcome to Malaysia. Just a short review. Suicide cases are now higher than the old politicians IQ. People losing family and face bankruptcy. All we see just a lack of competency. I just woke up. This is my morning voice. Um, I woke up and felt very productive, so I wanted to make a YouTube video about my recent viral videos on TikTok. I want to do more videos on my YouTube channel. I don't want to make it just a channel of covers. I want my YouTube channel to be more than YouTube covers. Excuse for the birds chirping. That's my neighbor's birds. It's always chirping in the morning, which is unfortunate because I'm doing the video right now, but whatever. I am just going to tell you how I got to that trend. When I saw this first video, he made this welcome to Indonesia trend, which was quite interesting because he was talking about the people in Indonesia that are not taking the vaccines. I mean, they it's not like they're not taking the vaccines. They do not believe in vaccines. They do not believe in COVID. Um, but they believe in like traditional stuff. They definitely do not believe in like science in general. So I thought it was pretty cool. The way that they criticize their society was pretty cool. With like this piano instrumental, the song is quite catchy and almost like a Disney, Disney-like songs. If you follow me on my TikTok from long time ago, you would know that I love this script writing kind of videos because before this i made the uh yeah cool joda wa the korean tiktok girl yeah cool joda wa ka and then also hey jenny da 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 the one that jenny jenny wait if i if i remember i'll put the video Oh my god, did you see the new kid? What new kid? Over there. I think his name is Abu. Is he clever? No. What a loser. But let's see if his brain worth right here. I love this kind of stuff. Like I'll just love writing and then make it into like something theatrical, musical kind of videos on TikTok. That's how I got into this trend basically. I would say that I was the first one in Malaysia. No, I wasn't the first one in Malaysia that did this trend, but I was the first one to blow up with this trend. When I was writing the lyrics, it was the time when people on social media tweeted to be exact. Um, people were so mad with this government. There was just so many things that we can't do, but they can do it. <laughs> For instance, like those ministers who were eating durian and then they were lying saying that it was from years ago when they got caught up. They said that they were confused and they were ready to be testified. So that was actually like bullshit. And then there were also like other ministers who were claiming this initiative that the society did, which is the white flag. The white flag was initiated by the this bird, I'm so sorry. So this white flag thing was initiated by the Malaysians, by the society. And suddenly that morning, this minister, women, I don't know what minister of what, but this woman made a poster claiming that this is her thing. The society invented this movement because they're not doing their job. But then suddenly they want to claim that it's their initiative. 
on the fact that it is their failure of not delivering their job. Let's just say everyone was struggling and, and also that time the suicide cases were rising like crazy, it's increasing. I saw videos of people suicide, just so unfortunate. That was like the reason why I made it about politics. And then people were like, oh, you're just talking shit about your country. No one really did this trend talking bad about their country, whatever. Then I was like, bitch, have you seen other TikTokers from other countries? Like, have you seen them? Have you seen their videos? So when this other comment appearing on my video, I was honestly like terrified because I don't know, I thought I was able to be to get jailed for that because I was talking about like politics because you know in Malaysia though the fact that this is a democratic country though the fact that you can voice out your opinion whatsoever sometimes you can't really voice that out I've seen a lot of people that's basically arrested for this so I was thinking that I could be arrested for this because I was talking about this like politicians the lyrics were like politicians are scumbag I basically didn't have an easy feelings and when the video blew up I was like oh my god and then there were also like comments like this might affect your future why do you have to make it so negative and then there are also people like healthcare workers are trying so hard but here's the thing I was not talking about healthcare the floor frontliners in general I was talking about the politics the fact that they don't have an effective strategy even the My Sujahtra app, I haven't even got any update on my vaccination. If there's anything that I wish for this country, it's for us to achieve the herd immunity. I hope you guys understand why I came up with that video. And I'm pretty sure most of you, <laughs> most of you like that video. Like, you guys are crazy about it. And then I went on Twitter and uploaded and it's also viral on Twitter. And then people are coming to me DM and saying that the fact that they love what I was doing. They were also being thankful the fact that I was using my platform to voice out my opinion about the current situation to you know address the issue so that people are more aware about that. Yeah, I think that's, that's all that I'm gonna say. If you are suffering mentally, please seek help. I mean I understand the situation sometimes you can't bear with it anymore. I'm not the one to say it because I don't walk in your shoes. I'm not living in your shoes. But still, I really want the best for us. Yeah, I think that's all. Bye guys. Thank you for watching this video. I will be posting my Here's Your Perfect cover and also how I record my cover. So stay tuned for that. Bye.